Brian with Short Circuit of Brewers, and I am here in the Anvil booth speaking to Matt Sloan about some of the history of Anvil as well as some of the products that they've recently come out with. Uh, tell us a little bit about what the idea behind Anvil is and then how it got started. So Anvil Brewing Equipment is a collaboration between John Palmer and John Blickman to come together to make a mid-market product that had the quality of Blickman Engineering without the price tag. So we carry uh, kettles between a five gallon all the way up to a 20. We have bucket fermenters, burners, scales, all kinds of accessories. Okay, yeah, and I've actually tested out one of the five-gallon kettles recently on a uh, induction system, which is nice because they are induction capable. Yes. I know that a lot of it, you know, is gas-fired behind it, but it, it's nice that those kettles are also the, induction capable the as well. The option is there. Yeah, and they work really well, and they're built like a tank. So, uh, tell us, I know you guys had some recent products that came out, um, I think like a pump and a scale. So yes. what, uh, what are those items and uh, tell us a little bit about those. We have a small brewing pump that we just released. It's perfect for small batches. It's a three gallon per minute uh, brewing pump. It's tool free disassembly. It's a plastic impeller, magnetic driven, super easy to clean. Uh, we've recently updated our forge burner. Uh, it's a 72,000 BTU burner up from our previous burner being a 45,000. Now the scales, what, what is the, the maximum capacity on the scales? You've got a big scale for like doing grains and then you've also got a small scale for like doing hops and other additions? Yes. Our uh, large scale is max capacity of 65 pounds and our small one goes up to I believe 4.4 pounds. The small one measures the grams up to a tenth of a gram and the ounces to a thousand. So it's very accurate. Okay. And uh, I know you guys also have another uh, product that you have in the line which is the uh, fermenter. Uh, tell us a little bit about what sizes are available on that. Our bucket fermenters come in a, a max capacity of a seven, seven gallon and a four gallon. Um, perfect for your five gallon batches, your two and a half gallon batches. They have a cone bottom, a uh, rotating racking arm on the inside. They are uh, at the perfect price point at the four gallon being at $100 and uh, the seven gallon being at a, I believe, 130 Okay. And then you also have a kit that will allow you to brew you know, go through your boil process and all that stuff and then actually ferment in the yes. in the kettle, right? Yes. All of our kettles from the five gallon to the 20 gallon come with a ferment and a kettle kit. Uh, it's an extra kit. I believe the prices are between 20 and $30 added on to your kettle. Um, all the kettles come with a pre-drilled hole in the lid. You could take out the grommet that, that uh, exists in it and then replace it with a new grommet and an airlock. There's a sanitary nut that comes to cover up the threads of the thermometer um, and a Teflon washer so you can use the dip tube actually as a racking arm. No, oh, that's nice. So yeah, I'm a big fan of the, the one kettle that I've used so far, and I, I imagine that quality extends all the way up to the largest one that you have. So uh, if you're looking for a great solution for not a lot of money, I mean, I, I can tell you from my experience, the kettles are tanks. All the other products look stellar in my opinion. I haven't used all of them, but I'd probably, I'm probably i probably gonna look at getting a couple of them to take a look at and uh, do a little bit of review for you guys on. But I think uh, for the money, if you're just starting out, you can buy one of these and, and it's gonna last you a really long time, if not forever, and you can use it for something else if you move up. So, Matt, I really appreciate you taking the time. It's always a pleasure. <laughs> Absolutely. This has been Brian at NHC for Short Circuit of Brewers. If you'd like to see more coverage on the show floor, click or tap the screen right here. And if you'd like to see our behind the scenes travel vlog, click or tap the screen right here. We'll see you on the next video.